Well, it's a uh, really freezing day today, but otherwise, uh, okay. It's clear skies. Um, getting into winter, yeah, a little bit of a breeze, but not too much of a breeze. Um, water's pretty much, uh, well, maybe not dead calm, but... Uh, okay, we had a bit of a false start. Peter didn't have any credits on his phone. Uh, his phone is now dressed up. Peter, why do you need credits on the phone? Uh, I need credits on the phone because uh, I use my phone connect to, to connect to Vodafone, and... Uh, from Vodafone I connect using uh, GPRS to, to my server at home and my server at home is where we transfer the data. So my boat sends data to home and uh, the, the machine here, the computer here, the control computer, uh, that connects to home as well and that gives commands to the boat and receives data about where the boat is and so on, which allows us to track it. Um, which all works really well unless you don't have credit on your phone, in which case Vodafone won't let you connect and the whole thing falls over. So uh, we just rushed off and uh, got some credit on my phone to, to come back and hopefully uh, get things underway. My boat is now 100% functional. With the GPS and GPRS and the fidget control, we're all working fine. Here you see the boat manoeuvring. Unfortunately, although everything seems to be working, there's still a pretty major problem with it. After setting the track, it still doesn't follow the track, it just goes around in circles and doesn't seem to be following anything particularly much at all. I think this is essentially because the, uh, the GPS isn't getting a fine enough track.